we will find a way I'm sure and obviously that way was wrong no 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 wrong way one local lady told me sir run run but this is now real jungle trail end I'm wrong Welcome back here in my Thailand adventure. In Koh Samui I decided to take a break from my travel plans. I was actually pretty exhausted and tired from the last weeks. So I decided to take the ferry from Samui to Koh Phangan and to stay a couple of days on this beautiful island. So I'm sitting on the back of this tuk-tuk waiting for my drive for 50 baht to my resort. It's not far away, I could walk, it's just 10 minutes. By the way, the luggage, I think I prefer to pay 50 baht. And so I drove towards Hadrian Beach and now we're ready to explore the island together. So I arrived at Koh Phangan here at my resort where I stay for the next couple of days. It's pretty nice here, look at this. So and now let's explore the area here. I have actually no idea what's around here. Usually in this area there is the full moon party. But now we have half a moon, no full moon, so no party for now. So I will have a quiet stay, hopefully, for the next couple of days. afternoon <clears throat> one o'clock and as you can see pretty pretty peaceful town here so here you can see it's not main season a lot of stores are closed at the moment even the 7-eleven is closed <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, where we are. But yeah, I was actually quite happy it was for once a bit quiet. And so I enjoyed the evening at the beach in Hadrin. In the next morning, it was time to watch the sunrise. Yes, actually, I hate to get up early, but this place was so peaceful. Yeah, look at this. was the beginning of a resting day. I walked a bit at the beach and enjoyed Hadrin for the next hours. For the next day, yes, I had already some plans. Day 4 here at Tommy's Resort on Koh Phangan and today I try to find a viewpoint. Follow me. Here you get a room 
for 100 baht. 100 baht is around three US dollar, if I'm right. Must be a pretty good deal. Should we try it? No, we will not try it. Tomorrow my plane drives me back or better say it flies me back to Bangkok. I guess that's the lookout I'm searching for. The only question is, how do I reach that lookout without getting bitten by snakes falling down a cliff? We will find a way, I'm sure, totally sure. Just don't believe Google Maps. This over there is Koh Samui. We are around 12 kilometers far away from Koh Samui. I think I'm lost. Whoa! Goodness! And obviously that way was wrong. Google, you are such a pain in my ass. No, 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 wrong way. Go back through the jungle. Somewhere over there is the Hadrian Pier. Here is the lower beach. The view here is absolutely, absolutely great. Well done, we got it. So. I'm here at the second viewpoint, Hadrin viewpoint. Here's a trail and the trailhead should start in 250 meters. One local lady told me, sir, run, run. Yes, run means hot. Café run, hot coffee. That's what I learned last night when I was sitting on the table with those super nice people from the Tommy Resort. The Tommy Resort is the place where I'm staying. And last night I was on one table with four staff. We teach each other some languages and we sing happy birthday for one other customer. If you come here, highly recommend the Tommy Resort. Where is the trailhead? That's the question. I'm lost again. If I believe the map, here is the viewpoint. But as you can see, here is nothing else than a forest. Holy shit! I was a snake, but already gone. At least I found a ribbon. Trail end? I'm wrong. Now I really lost the way. Here I'm totally wrong. Here is no trail anymore. So I'll go back down, see if I find a different way. Otherwise, I will return to the town. That was now quite an exploration. So this here is the right way to the viewpoint. We did it. At the end, we are never lost. So I'm back in the hotel. The hike took me almost eight kilometer 
two and a half hours it was pretty challenging but now I'm back in the hotel got some water and will cool down in the sea yeah so and that's what I also did I didn't move too much anymore in that evening believe me the next day I had to leave to Bangkok so my time out on Kosamui on Kopangan came finally to an end in the last episode of this series you are able to see what happened next when I arrived in Bangkok and when I got hit by COVID. But more about this you can see in the next final episode. Stay tuned!